Hello everyone, it's Old Guardian here. In this Nestled Event Task Guide, I'm going to take a look at Nestled Event Task number 4, complete the Captain Galvangar bounty with only humans, elves and dwarves. And this can be done on normal, which is really good for a budget team, because for a budget team there's only 7 available mercenaries, so I'm using 6 of those. And this is my budget squad. I'm using Cariel with Tome of Light, Kurtus with Demon Guard, Cornelius with Shield of Dawn, Tavish with High Power Rounds, Tyrande with Verdant Recurve, and Warden with Potion of Ice. For the climb, I'm typically using Cariel Kurtus Tyrande or Cariel Kurtus Warden, depends a little on the fight. And then for the final boss fight, I'm using Cariel Kurtus and Cornelius. And that's pretty much the story. Obviously, if you happen to have Varian Rin, then replacing Cornelius with Varian Rin would make the final fight even more easy. But overall, this wasn't as bad on a budget as I had feared. And this is what it all looks like. In action. Okay, Galvangar with only humans, elves and dwarves, budget edition. There's a total of seven available characters, so I'm using six of those. But we'll see how it goes. With this squad, I probably will need to work on that green one first, the add. I don't think I can actually take down Galvangar as the first one. We'll need, we'll need to take down this one first. And then take down, take down the adds and then finally Galvangar. There, one add is down. Galvangar is going to become immune. This one is going to keep Attacking. We're going to attack right back into it, right? I believe so, yes. Random aimed assault. Gives immune, but what if it hits into Galvangar instead? 20, 30, 40. I think I need to do Demon Slayer here. Not quite the same without Varian. If this Cornelius would be a Varian, this would be such a simple task. But even in this form, the team can still get it done. The fact that the ability gains cooldown. Yeah, well, I don't think I mind. Let's just blast into that. So this can be done on a budget too. Which is of course of course fun to see. I guess Stormcrest deals the most damage. Really, really doesn't matter. Because we're just going to blast in. I'm going to become immune though. Demon Slayer does go in. Oh, Demon Slayer goes in. It's it's all good, it's all good. If I win the 50 50 roll, then, then Galvangar is dead. If I don't, then it lasts another turn, but also doesn't doesn't matter in the end. And now it's dead. Very, very dead. And that's a task for completed with the budget squad. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the content, please click the like button, subscribe to my channel and check out my Twitch channel.